always appreciate a crunch of eggs. Well, and food, baby. Not y'all everything. Mm. <laughs> Sitting there looking like baps, and that was a snap. My bad, don't do that. If do you understand the verb that is coming out of my mouth? <laughs> <laughs>
Since you did this, Thank you. you did that. I'll give it to you. Ooh. You know, you gotta get props to what props Ooh. do. Y'all, one of my favorite things to cook is fish. Mm -hmm. I'm known in the family for frying my fish. Everybody asks me to fry fish at the lunch. I was gonna say, she done took it over. You used to have me fry the fish and she, she started and said, baby, going on. That's just how I gotta do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I hope y'all doing well though. Yes. I hope y'all got y'all a meal. I know. Just pull up and sup with us. Exactly. Because we are truly hungry. <laughs> and this food is good. Mm -hmm. That's, ooh, bye bye, Mm-hmm. Yeah, I ain't mean, like a good home cooked meal. I never liked it, okay. <laughs> What's going to say? You got sauce on side of your lips. Yeah, I am hungry. Please, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I didn't see that. Yeah. <laughs> woo! No, woo! Another blessing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then I took some. Do you taste the crawfish juice in, it's in the, mm -hmm. the pasta? Mm -hmm. I can some see of that, it. some of that crawfish juice. You can see it. And put it in the pasta, baby. Let me tell you something. That's one of the, when I tell you, that is one of the best things you could do. There was this one one year I went to, uh, when I was an undergrad, this church on campus had a uh, crawfish boil. They had a bunch left, and so they, they were like, y'all take these crawfish. So they gave us like a box of crawfish to go out. And Back at the time, I had a small apartment. I didn't have all of the the equipment to eat crawfish. You gotta have equipment to eat crawfish to do it right. I gotta have equipment. You gotta mm -hmm. have equipment. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> what equipment you gotta have to eat crawfish? Tell I gotta have my tray. Then you know you gotta either take like you gotta what? you gotta have a bag to put the stuff in. All I need home. is a box. All I need is a box. Like I said, I needed my equipment. So anyway, I'm what I did was it's bad and bullshit. <laughs> That's me. So what I did was I took and I peeled the crawfish and I poured the juice off and I made uh it wasn't fish crawfish sauce but I made like a crawfish. I honestly think it was like a because that was back in money. Was funny. I think it was like a little pack of some like prepared pasta and I added the crawfish mm -hmm. to it as a protein and some of the juice. Oh, that was good. What? Good ain't even the word. It was great. Mm -hmm. Baby, when you in college. Or when you and when you struggling, hmm, you baby, you gonna make something out of nothing, okay? I remember, I had never forget. You know, the dorm rooms used to have the kitchen. You know, nobody ever used it. Mm -hmm. So my freshman year, I went down to my to in my dorm kitchen one time, and I made me some shrimp scampi, and I never went back. <laughs> but at one point, I did bring me a little. <laughs> Right, we used to do Boy, some stuff. I never went there. I didn't. But I bought me a little toaster oven into my room. Mm -hmm. That one mom and them had, the little black one. Mm -hmm. Baby, I cooked something. I figured I'm did me some chicken. Kind of as hot as the thing got. I could have put a pot on top of it and made me some pasta. It, it got so hot up in that room. But I tell you, that food was good, though. It sure was. Child. It was so good. And then I had, <laughs> then I had my little seasonings in the... Um, in a little basket underneath my bed. I wasn't no. cooking it in college. Well, until I got my apartment. But in the dorm room, I made all different kind of ramen. How you made ramen in your dorm? Oh, in the microwave? Mm-hmm. Oh, that is true. Mm -hmm. I sure did. I never used the, the community kitchen. It was dirty. And people had left their pots in there. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh -huh. pencils. I was like, I, ain't, I can't do this no more. Ain't nobody got time for this. Mm -mm. Y'all mm -mm. gone. Y'all need to clean up behind y'all self. It's tripe now. Mm -hmm. But um, That little edge piece was crunchy. I appreciate it. I, mm -hmm. I always appreciate a crunchy edge. Well, in food, baby. Not y'all edges being crunchy. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> baby, let me tell you something. If your edges is crunchy. You're going to be sitting there looking like baps. If y'all don't know what baps is, Google it. Not bad. I said what I said. I don't know. I mean, cause baby, I just know if I was to touch that hair in that movie, 
It was gonna uh, flake just like this fish. Or you might have got cut. <laughs> 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 I got cut. And that was a stop. Bebe, don't do that. Okay. I had to slave over that stove. I was truly hungry. And my daddy gonna... was here. He was even had this plate clean. I, look, I ain't gonna lie. I think the Lord whispering to me double portion. Really? Okay, drink what he's saying. I don't know what the trouble you done been in. He said double for your trouble. The trouble that I went through was waiting for the food to be there. That was my trouble. So I'm, I'm gonna get my, my I'm gonna be recompensed. I'm gonna be recompensed. That's what the that's what the bishop told me at church. But y'all look. Uh, baby, I hope y'all had y'all a good meal versus just sitting here watching us eat because that food was good, good to me. Good. I mean I just hold on. That's what I'm saying. No. We gotta go fix me another plate because I'm. I might have to do a, re a, 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 a video. Well, it was in my intention to record a video on how I made everything, but baby, let me tell you something. I had just gotten in the kitchen and started cooking and forgot to turn the camera on. So. I be sometimes. Y'all saying the after cook. Exactly. And it was. And it was. It, it was selectable. Okay. okay. It sure was, child. I just. I'm trying to go collect me some more. But y'all, in, in, in that same thing, we're going to go on and log off. We love y'all so much. We truly, we truly love y'all. Y'all have been, y'all have been great. Truly a blessing. You've been kind. Mm -hmm. But we need more, y'all. So go on and tell your cousins and your auntie and your uncle and baby and her kids and, and the cousins and, all of and uh, your friends and your coworkers <laughs> and just everybody you can think of. Just tell them about the indie takeover. Since y'all made it to the end of this video, make sure you go ahead and like this video. Leave us a comment down below. <laughs> If Do you understand the verb that is coming out of my mouth? <laughs> <laughs> I am Ooh, so dead. That's, that was room. That's what that was. What that's what you call make room. Come on, come on. You better that's tell me. That's what them. you call make room. I'm trying to, cause I'm. I done made room Child. for my double portion. But y'all, if you made it to the end of this video and you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, and we will see y'all in the next video. We love y'all. We'll see you next time. Bye. Peace.